Um, Ms. Dixon, your son has something to tell you, and he thought it would be best if he told you here in church with his pastor. Well, I just want to say it's finally time I told you something about myself that I've been afraid to tell you for a, a long time. Mm hmm I'm... I'm... Remember, speak the truth, and the truth will set you free. <laughs> I'm gay. <laughs> That's it! <laughs> That's what you drove me down here for! Boy, I knew that even before you did. I knew it when you was nine years old. <laughs> and you're okay with me, Of please. course I'm okay. Mom, I love you. I love you too, baby. <laughs> but I got to go. Uh, well, there is one other thing. What's that? Well, I met this young man, and we've been friends now for a couple of months, son. I'd like to bring him to church with me this Sunday. Well, bring him. And afterwards, we'll go back to the house for my Sunday pot roast dinner. Now, I got to go look at the time. Uh, there is one more thing. Now what? <laughs> I thought we were done. Well, let's hear it. Well, this young man I'm saying, uh, he's white. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't hear that. I said he's white. He's light? <laughs> not, not light, Miss Dixon, what he said. Ah, what he said. <laughs> now, just how white is he? Very. He's Irish. Uh, his name is Daniel O'Connor. Daniel. Good biblical name. <laughs> Mama, I know once you meet him, you'll love What's him. What's the matter with you, boy? There aren't enough nice black men out there. You got to go face. <laughs> please, now you just got to give him a chance to explain. It's, it's all you doing. I knew you would trouble a second I laid eyes on you. Well, the pastor had nothing to do with Why don't you talk back to me? <laughs> See, you need therapy. <laughs> you done gone crazy! Look, 